I went through so so many products they are thicker it will also give you bounce it will give you texture the smell of this product is divine another favorite of mine obviously we only have favorites in this video on station I couldn't find any consistent one so basically a hair routine from start to finish so the trick is to find the right amount for you long story short guys if you have thin fine flat hair keep on watching hello you guys how are you all doing i was just about to go out and i was getting ready earlier and what i was actually thinking is that if i would have forgotten at least one of these products at home i would not have been able to make my hair look the way i love it to look and also i remember i was browsing youtube uh, watching hundreds and hundreds of videos looking for products for thin fine and flat hair and i couldn't find any consistent one so basically a hair routine from start to finish so i thought i would share my hair routine with you guys i believe you'll find this useful so let's get started as i mentioned earlier i do have a very thin fun super silky super uh, liquidy hair and i do need product that will give my hair some texture uh, that will give me volume and also density because i'm lacking all of that how lucky can you get so let's start with shampoos i wash my hair every single day especially if i work out i do realize people have uh, different preconceptions about this fact however i've made my decision i like my hair clean so let's stop here at the moment i'm only using two shampoos uh, one of them is the revitalash thickening shampoo i've also mentioned this product in my revitalash review i'll link the video somewhere down below access to this product um, this one is supposed to improve uh, scalp health it is supposed to make your hair stronger and now actually saying that i'm realizing that i don't see um, so much hair in my shower uh, so i'm assuming this product is actually working this one will last you for ages you only need the tiniest amount so with my hair thickness and length uh, i only need like a pea size amount this one lovers amazingly well a very important tip with this product you have to leave this product in for at least two to three minutes so how i would usually apply this i would just massage it at the scalp and leave it on for two to three minutes in the shower and then um, do the rest of my stuff um, please do that because otherwise you won't see results it took me a bottle to realize that so please uh, don't repeat my mistakes this shampoo is also supposed to uh, make your hair thicker i'm not so sure about the um, uh, thickening part however i can definitely see that my hair looks fuller uh, this shampoo gives my hair some texture so i would not recommend this if you have um, frizzy hair um, i believe this is one of the main reasons i actually love this um, product is because it gives my hair some texture and it makes my hair a bit Coarser, I would say. Long story short, guys, um, anyone who has fine hair, anyone suffering from thinning hair, I do recommend this product. This is definitely worth the 40 pounds uh, price tag. This will also last you for ages. As I said, you only need the tiniest amount. And you don't need to use this every single day like I do. I've been using this for at least six months and I still have more than half i believe and as i've mentioned earlier i do wash my hair every single day great product for some texture great product for volume great product overall so my second product is um guys by the way please ignore this i've been on the beach today and i've got sunburn so as you can see I'm completely different colors everywhere. I'm super red here. I'm not as red here. Never mind. So, my second product is uh, Asphalt Seal. I believe this is how you pronounce the name. I apologize if I mispronounce it. So, because I use um, volumizing products every single day, uh, my scalp suffers from that. So, it tends to get super dry, super itchy. 
I've tried so, so many products from different big name brands and nothing has helped. So I managed to find this shampoo, which actually helped, I believe within a week or two, I saw results. I was actually amazed by it. Um, I usually purchase this on Amazon. I believe it's like 12 pounds, if I'm not wrong. So if you suffer from uh, itchy scalp, dermatitis, dry scalp, uh, give it a try. Uh, you won't regret it, believe you guys. And as I said, it's uh, super inexpensive, but definitely worth it. Uh, that is asphalt seal picture here or here somewhere. Next step would be conditioners. Um, I probably went through tens or maybe hundreds of uh, conditioners and uh, not affordable ones guys however nothing got me too excited I was not super impressed with anything until I've tried this one guys. Uh, so these babies Plumping Rinse from Kevin Murphy. The smell of this product is divine. Actually, my mom was asking me today what perfume am I wearing uh, after I've used this. Uh, this is how amazing it smells. And believe me guys, if this came in a perfume, I would be the first one to purchase this because it smells, wow, like anything else I've tried before. Um, apart from that, it will make your hair super shiny, super sleek, it will not weigh down your hair, it will definitely make your hair plumper, everything what you ever wanted from a conditioner, if you have thin, fine hair, this one will give you. I think uh, the fact that I took a super sized bottle on a holiday with me says it all, I'm obsessed, highly recommend if you have thin, fine hair. It's an obsession of mine at the moment and you will shortly see that I'm obsessed with quite a few Kevin Murphy products uh, and obviously this is not sponsored as you can see I have like 10 followers so this is definitely not sponsored I'm just obsessed with their products okay, so once I'm out of a shower this is where the party starts I'm looking at all the products um, I'll be talking about next and I'm realizing that this is a bit exaggerated, however this is what works um, well for me. Uh, so my first product of choice would um, obviously be foams. I apply foams mainly on my roots and for years and years guys I've been using the Kerastase uh, green one, I forgot. Uh, the name of it. However, it was the green one. I've used the white beige one. Uh, however, I've got something better for you. And this one is um, Schwarzkopf Got To Be Volumaniac. This one is amazing. Uh, in my humble opinion, this is better than the Kerastase foams. Um, this one will give you a lot of body, uh, it is not sticky, it will not make your hair coarse, it gives you insane volume that lasts indeed. I love this, I had no issues with this so far, actually except from one, I just remembered. Um, remember earlier I told you that I'm using the Asphalt Seal Shampoo because um, my scalp tends to get a bit dry and itchy and i believe this product is what made my scalp super dry so the combination of the two works perfectly fine for me so now i'm able to use this product i'm not 100 percent sure this is just my assumption guys so please don't uh, take my word for it uh, this one is uh, super affordable it's like three pounds i believe in super drug or boots and i've been using this for at least uh, two years now and I love everything what this has to offer and this one is got to be volumey. Next, another love of mine, uh, Kevin Murphy Anti-Gravity Spray. So this is a volume spray, it is supposed to also give you oil-free shine. Um, I really see a difference when I use this product. My hair is bouncier, uh, it is thicker although it doesn't market itself as being a thickening product 
However, I do believe my hair looks thicker when I use this product. Um, be careful with this. Uh, if you have fine hair, uh, don't over apply because this will make uh, your hair um, greasy. What I usually do is I would first use the foam all over my head and I would only apply the anti-gravity spray in the center of my head and this will give you shine, it will give you the bounce that you're looking for, uh, volume as well. This one is a great product, again I brought the full-sized bottle with me and I believe that says it all. So Kevin Murphy anti-gravity spray, it's a love of mine. Uh, talking about anti-gravity spray, I also have the anti-gravity cream this is a gel actually i'll show you the texture very quickly it's like a gel formula uh, this has been sent to me by mistake i was actually ordering the spray and uh, cold beauty they sent me this by mistake i've tried using this um, i believe this is for um, men with longer hair doesn't really work out for me i could use it however i do prefer the spray but it does the exact same thing great if you're a man and you need some volume some shine some bounce in your hair uh, this one would be for you full again another brilliant product from uh, kevin murphy obviously um this one i would apply on the length of my hair i would avoid the roots this will not only make your hair thicker it will also give you bounce it will give you texture um, in my personal uh, experience uh, this makes my hair again a bit um, plumper and fluffier the trick with this product is to find the right amount for your hair basically if you don't apply enough uh, you won't see the effect if you apply too much this will weigh down your hair so the trick is to find the right amount for you um, again it has the exact same smell oh my god as the conditioner um, the only con with this product is the packaging you can't get the last bits of product from here uh, I mean, it looks gorgeous, I agree. However, it is very difficult to squeeze out the product uh, once this product is about to finish. Kevin Murphy, please, if you could fix it, uh, that would be wonderful. Otherwise, a uh, great, great product, I uh, highly recommend. Um, this is full again, thickening lotion. Next product I would apply on my hair is uh, Moroccan oil. I am sure everyone knows uh, what this is. Uh, this version in particular is the regular one for all hair types. At home I have the one, the lighter version basically. Um, I don't see any difference between the two of them to be super honest with you. So I don't mind any. Uh, I've been using this for many, many years. I've been alternating between this one and the Kerastase oils. Uh, I know that um, at the moment there are so, so many new um, products on the market. However, I prefer to stick uh, with something that works for me. And this product has been working so far. Uh, works great, does the job. This one is Moroccan oil. Last product in today's video and also in my hair care routine, this is Oribe Super Shine Cream. This is not a product for fine hair guys, I'll tell you that straight away. This is super, super heavy. It will make your hair greasy, like greasy. I will show you the amount that I usually use and I'm not even joking. This is the amount I usually use and I don't even apply this straight onto my hair. What I'll do, I'll usually mix this in with the um, full again lotion and then I would apply this on my hair. Um, yes, it does make your hair super shiny, 
I will show you on the palm of my hands. As you can see, my palms are super shiny and this is how your hair is supposed to look. However, your hair, if it's super fine, it will look greasy. Uh, let me whisk and apply the tiniest amount. This is how careful I am with these guys because we obviously don't want greasy hair. So what has happened to me with this product? I was going out, I purchased this, uh, first time using it, and obviously I applied a good amount on my hair because I wanted super shiny hair, and my hair was looking greasy, like greasy, like I haven't washed my hair for a month. Uh, so since then I am super careful with this product. Um, yeah if you have coarse hair yes i'd recommend this not for fine hair bow i'm sorry Oribe. this was my first product from them and i was not impressed i really hope um the rest of the products are not so disappointing okay guys that was everything for today i really hope you enjoyed this video i also hope i managed to help at least one person with thin fine hair uh, please do let me know if there are any products you think i should be trying also do let me know what your favorite product is in the comments down below i'll make sure to try that one as well otherwise i shall see you in